Hello again, Kevin Lindgren here. Need to talk to you a little bit about paying for your product. You are going to be paying for your product and then shipping it to your customer. Your customer is going to be paying you first via PayPal, but especially if you're brand new, PayPal will hold that money until you prove you have shipped it and they have received the product. Um, this is usually for 90 days and you have to do I think it's 25 or 30 positive sales in those 90 days. Uh, once you've proven that then there is no more restrictive hold on your funds. Um, but a lot of suppliers don't take PayPal so PayPal here so one thing you can do is I showed you how to go ahead in one of the beginning videos make sure you do a free business account uh, and then go ahead and request a debit card um, because that's the same as using a bank debit card once you get that in your hot little hands um, and then you know let's say you uh, listed this what is this a uh, bar tool set over on eBay and it's $42.99 let's say you listed it for $65 and sold one um, your customer is gonna send that $65 to your PayPal PayPal will notify you hey you made a sale you know your money is in your account however there is a hold until you have shipped it um, so what you have to do is have a little bit of money to start out with uh, and then you just come over here you just add it to your cart and I'll walk all the way through a, a uh, thing why do I have two things in my cart okay I'm going to delete that one um, and you some of these you want to do as a gift some items uh, sold do not allow gift options um, but if you go ahead and just proceed to check out, um, I think this is the right account. Uh, well, there's my address. I ain't gonna worry about blocking that out. Um, but you want to obviously change this to your customer's address. Payment method, you can use any credit card or even a debit card. Sometimes they'll send you promo codes or gift cards. Um, right there is where you would enter that. And down here is the free two-day shipping. I... Um, Oh, actually, I'm on a pro. I think I'm on Prime account. Um, yeah, Prime. Yeah, free no rush shipping, free standard shipping. Before I do that, add a gift receipt. Um, yeah, you want to click on add a gift receipt. Prices will be hidden. And you can, if you want, hi. Uh, thank you for your purchase on eBay from and either your name or your eBay business name. And then uh, that way the prices are hidden on the receipt. Save gifts options. And then if you have a account that has Prime, make sure you don't select it. Um, July 
August 7th is five days from now, so uh, so there it would be. Um, obviously, I'm not going to order this because I've actually already got it, but that is all there is to how you pay for your product and how you place an order. Um, Prime Pantry, I don't even know what that is. Uh, but again, you're, you are going to need a little bit of money in an account to get started. There is no risk because your customer over here on eBay is going to sell, uh, send you money over here to your PayPal account. You're going to be notified from PayPal that there's money sitting in there, but you have to ship it first. And, they ha and your customer has to receive it in good condition. Um, so if something happens to that order, then all you have to do is just do a return and it's just like it never happened um, but once you get uh, and I'll be telling you to go ahead and list 10 15 20 items uh, I realize most people are not gonna have the cash to you know handle that but believe me not everything that you list is gonna sell right away especially when you first start out you kind of building up to it so like the first week you might sell one item and then three or four days later you'll sell another item by then the money from your first sale is released uh, into your PayPal account um, and then as they pick up you know just keep don't withdraw any money out of your PayPal for the first 90 days and you'll build up your initial investment with the profit uh, that is the way to do that um, and you can always slow down your ebay listings you know if you are running out of money or don't have any money to buy anything else all you have to do is just go into your seller account um, selling and go down to your active listings and just select all and turn them off for a few days um, that's all you have to do um, so that's all there is to paying for your product see you in the next video